Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how site owners can access the term store from a SharePoint site. Uh, let me explain to you the use case. So uh, first of all, what is the term store? Um, term store is essentially um, like a global database of uh, labels, um, you know, metadata tags that you can use and reuse in your environment. And, you know, you maintain the term store typically, um, um, you know, from the admin center because it's global, right? So I am actually a SharePoint admin. That's why I can navigate to it. So typically you just navigate to the SharePoint admin center. And from here you under content services, uh, term store. And this is where you get to see the, you know, essentially all the different metadata tags that you, um, you know, defined uh, for your users, right? Uh, that are used to be and re reused uh, by everyone in your in your tenant in your environment. However, what I just showed you requires admin access, right? If you are a small organization, you know, most likely you might have admin access to this area, but for large organization, this is definitely off limits. Uh, so let's say I want to, you know, I want uh, some site owners, you know, for particular departments to maintain their, um, you know, essentially their own, uh, you know, term sets. Um, obviously, so what I did here, uh, and I believe I recorded a video on this on my YouTube channel already, I made Mary, one of my, you know, HR people, maybe, you know, site owners, uh, the manager of this, you know, particular group of, uh, you know, terms, all right? Uh, that HR will only use. Uh, but, you know, how will Mary, so Mary now needs to uh, essentially, um, you know, um, change the uh, the labels, right? Manage all the labels, manage all the terms um, yeah, in here. Uh, how, how can she do it without, uh, you know, uh, without admin access, all right? So let me show you how. So I'm actually in this other uh, browser right here. I'm logged in as Mary. And Mary, you know, is on her HR team site. And Mary uh, is the owner of the site. So very important, you need to be the owner of the site uh, to access the term store. Mary does not have admin access uh, at all. So Mary, there is no way she can navigate to the SharePoint Admin Center and, you know, manage the terms the way I just showed you. But Mary does need to maintain, you know, the, the metadata tags, the, the terms, the term sets uh, for HR. Let me show you how she can do it gear icon site information and view all site settings so Mary needs to go behind the scenes and there are a couple of ways to get to the term store so you can either click on the term store management all right right here and you get inside of the term store or another option let me just show you just another way you click on the site content types all right and then after that screen loads you just need to click on term store really it doesn't really matter you end up in the same place and what Mary now sees is essentially the global, you know, term store. All right. If if Mary clicks on the global term groups, look at this. She can see all of the different groups of terms that are available in the term store in the admin center. However, if you notice, right, um, it, it shows her that hey, you know, she cannot, you know, make any changes here because she is not the manager of this term groups, you know, uh, term sets. But look at this, HR, she can manage it. You see, she can uh, uh, add, you know, nothing can be done here, but under HR, she can add, uh, you know, a term sets. She can uh, essentially add, add, you know, add, add a delete uh, terms and pretty much manage it for her group, for her department, all right? Um, so this is very important. Again, this is very important because uh, most of your users, you know, assuming you're part of large organizations, are not going to have to have access to the global term store. Typically, only IT team has access to that admin center. Uh, with that being said, if IT makes you the manager of your of a particular group, right? Just like I have Mary here, uh, this will allow the site owners to navigate through the site settings. All right, just like I showed you through the site settings. Uh, not through admin center, um, the user would would be able to navigate to the term store and make the changes um, within the group within the terms that where they were given privileges. Uh, all right, uh, so that's all I really wanted to show you um, today. Uh, if you are the site owner, this is really critical. This is really important, of course, if you are using metadata. 
Um, again, hopefully you learned something new. Um, uh, as always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.